Hello, I'm Glenn Hall, and um, <clears throat> today is December 10th, 2022. I just completed the 22nd video in my Mark of the Beast series. <clears throat> I have um, uploaded all of those to BitChute, and I am not going to upload any more of those uh, to this channel. I'm going to put a link here in the description box so that you can go to that and watch that. The Lord led me over a period of six days to produce these 22 videos. He woke me up every night over these six days, beginning as it was moving from December 4th to December 5th. So basically starting on the 5th, 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, six days of a lot of work, uh, very little sleep. Some nights I only got, um, I think the least amount was either three hours or one and a half. I can't remember. <clears throat> but it's been a very, very interesting time. Um, I was surprised today that he awakened me again to complete the series. I thought I was going to get a full day of rest and perhaps do it tomorrow. I literally did not know what the last three videos, what the topics were going to be. But the Holy Spirit led me this morning to do all three and it totally fits it's like a seamless garment, the entire video series. Well, if you watch it all, you will see it's like a seamless garment because I take you through the entire Bible. I take you not not in order from Genesis to Revelation, but I take you all over the place and explain to you the plan of God, what the mark of the beast is, what the mark of God is, where we are today, what's happening, and what you can do. <clears throat> There's nothing like it on the internet. You will not find anything like it because everyone is still trying to make money, convincing you to store up food, buy guns, protect your assets, etc. No, it's too late for that. Babylon is falling. Babylon the Great is falling. They're telling us, and they're doing it on purpose, and I explain it in detail in these 22 videos. So I strongly encourage you to watch. It's more than just understanding the times, though. It's understanding the plan of God through history. I explain to you why, for example, Satan was in the Garden of Eden. Anyway, that's enough. There's, there's a lot there, and I encourage you to watch it. 